A South Carolina lawmaker who's running for Congress is having more surgery for injuries suffered in a highway accident. Spokesman Michael Mule says State Representative Katie Arrington was in surgery late Sunday afternoon. He said in a text message that he would have an update on her condition later. The 47 year old Arrington repeatedly highlighted you. S. Representative Mark Sanford's criticism of President Donald Trump as she defeated Sanford in a GOP primary earlier this month. The Charleston County Sheriff's Office has said Arrington and a friend were traveling southbound on U.S. Highway 17 on Friday evening when a vehicle traveling in the wrong direction hit their vehicle. The driver of the other vehicle died at the scene. The driver of Arrington's vehicle also sustained serious injuries. Arrington's campaign team said she suffered a broken back and ribs, among other serious injuries that have already required multiple surgeries President Donald Trump expressed concern over social media and posted on Twitter on Saturday that he was thinking about Arrington, writing, My thoughts and prayers are with Rep. Katie Arrington of South Carolina, including all of those involved in last night's car accident, and their families. Arrington is expected to be hospitalized for two weeks and then anticipates getting right back to work on her efforts to keep Republican control of the 1st Congressional District of South Carolina's House seat, according to her campaign. The campaign remained positive in its outlook while describing the incident over Arrington's verified Twitter account on Saturday morning, writing as we all know, Katie Arrington is an extremely strong woman and has tremendous faith and an incredibly supportive family. And it is from her strong faith, the support of her family, the prayers and support of our community, and the incredible doctors and staff at the hospital that she is certain she will be back to work for our state soon. The following specific details were shared by the campaign on Saturday last night, Katie Arrington and her friend were traveling to Hilton Head, where Katie was scheduled to receive an award from a state medical organization this morning. Katie was the passenger in the car traveling southbound on Highway 17 when a vehicle traveling in the wrong direction northbound in the southbound lanes of Highway 17 struck the vehicle containing Katie and her friend. Katie sustained a fracture in her back and several broken ribs, as well as injuries that required Katie to undergo major surgery including the removal of a portion of her small intestine and a portion of her colon. Additionally, the main artery in her legs has a partial collapse and will require a stint. Additional surgeries will be required including one likely today, and it is likely that Katie will remain hospitalized for the next two weeks. The driver of the other car was killed and has not been publicly identified. The campaign added, as her family asked last night, Katie asks for your continued prayers for the deceased and the deceased's family, as well as prayers for a quick recovery for Katie and her friend. Arrington defeated incumbent U.S. Representative Mark Sanford in South Carolina's June 12 primary and won the bid to represent the GOP in the general election for 1st Congressional District of South Carolina's House seat in the fall with strong support from Trump.